Okay, here we have the cutest little model horse ever. Um, he's not stable, mate. He's got a little logo on him there, um, but I'm not sure what it is. He's so tiny. Um, I'm probably asking about really cheap, about a pound fifty p or something for him. So make an offer. So here we have an intermediate um, equine quiz. As you can see, none of it's been done. Um, you fill in the answers in the book, it's a really good book, never been used. Um, ask you all questions, it's in top, con top condition, it's from Robinson. Um, so, just make an offer. Okay, so next we have a piebald, like, felt model horse, it's not briar. Um, it's got a lovely tail, it's got a few ear rubs though, on both sides. Um, he's in really good condition otherwise. Um, he's got like a few little tiny felty rubs on the bottom, like you can't even see them at all. Um, so yeah, I'm only asking like 150 a pound, something really cheap, just offer. Okay, and he does stand up. <laughs> okay, so here's like a paint model sports horse. Um, hog's mane, really short tail. He's a really good good condition though. I only want like a 50p or something for him, really cheap. So make an offer. Okay so next we have a red riding whip. Um, it's in really good condition. I've never ever used it before. Um, and a pony red head collar, pony side, in really good condition. Only ever been used like once. In really good condition you can either buy them together or you can buy them separate I'm not fussy really cheap so just offer okay so here's a rather large horse and pony care book it's in really good condition um, it's got some good information inside yeah um, yeah I'm not asking for much for that so, just make an offer. Two really nice Half Moon Ranch books. Um, I really enjoy the story in these. It's a really nice story. Um, this one's like, it's in really good condition. Um, £4 each this one was, but the cover's spotless and the inside spotless. And that is the Steamboat Charlie. And um, this one's Rodeo Rocky, as you can see. This one was five pound, but it's got like a tiny little crease there. Um, but again, the inside's also spotless. Um, so make an offer together or separate. Here we have an like the brand is I Love Ponies, and um, the magazine I think it is. Um, Daisy and Vanilla called Mare and Foal. Probably asking for about, I did pay quite expensive for them because like the brand and stuff, so I'm probably asking about um, 150 or £2 or something. Just make an offer. Here's a set of three Jenny Dale's Ponytails book, all in really good condition. I've like not even read them, very good condition. There's Willow the Wild Pony, Charlie the Champion Pony, and Sam the School Pony. Really good condition. They've been three pound each, so you can either buy them together or separate. Probably like a pound fifty p each, or maybe like yeah. Or you can buy them together. So here's a lead rope halter, a pink one. Um, I've never used it. It's got a few. Yeah, you can't even see it. Like a little tiny dirt mark there through to it just being in my box. Um, I'll open it and show you. Um, so here you go, um, that, there's the lead rope and then this bit here, one go, obviously you make it bigger, you extend it for what like size your pony head is, um, one bit goes behind the ears and then one goes like over the nose, um, and it's really nice, a really nice item, um, and I also have this one I showed you earlier, pony size one maybe if you've got like a really strong pony you might consider this one instead of that one but this one's lovely i love it so make an offer okay here's a horse pencil case there's a 
it's got a mirror on there and then it says happy the freedom is comfortable on the top and it's got a picture of horses and then you just let me open it you open it it's just plain inside nice and pencil really cheap make an offer here's three shelty the shetland pony books um, and there's the big show just shelty the shetland pony that's the first one and Shelty in the Runaway. Um, some of the covers are like really not in the best condition as you can see. Um, this one's in quite good condition. And that's got a little rip there. And so yeah, the insides are absolutely fine. It's just the outside cover. I'll only be asking about 25, 50 pence each or something. Maybe, yeah, so. Or you can make an offer, whatever you think's right. Okay, so here's a Lick It treat bar. It's for real life horses, obviously. It's like a sugary treat. You break it up like a chocolate bar. Um, not asking for a lot. Not much, really. About 70p or so. Not a lot. Maybe even less, so, yeah. Okay, here we have the three quite heavy plastic model horses. Um, you can either buy them together, which will be a bit cheaper, I think, or you can buy them separate. There's a cob, really good condition, as you can see. Um, like the racehorsey one, he's like in a racehorse pose. Um, and then there's like an Arabian with his leg up, but he has got a few rubs there, so not asking for a lot, separate or together. Um, so yeah, make an offer. Here's the little book of horses and ponies. It's got a lovely, like, padded cover. Um, it's in really good mint condition. Um, it's really useful inside as well. Let me just open it. You can see it's got about breeds, all the different breeds. Um, like, the shows, how to, like, do simple ride instructions, tacking up. It's, like, really useful. It tells you about a lot of things. Here's some horsey animal art books. Um, most of them are in good condition apart from the racehorse in the rain, which has got like a few tiny, tiny marks. You can't even see them. Tiny marks. Um, there's stallion in the stable, horse in the house, racehorse in the rain and foals in the field. Um, probably asking for about, I don't know, about a pound or something each. Or You can't buy them as a set. And they're really good to read. Um, you can't even tell they've been read, most of them. So, yeah, make an offer.